First of all, thank you very much, Dr. Umashenka, for sitting down with us for this interview. So let's begin our session with an introduction of yourself. Can you please talk about yourself? Yeah, definitely. Uh, thank you so much for this uh, interview. Nice interview. I am uh, Dr. Uma Shankar Subramanyam. So I am working here as an associate professor and a researcher in the Renewable Energy Lab, Department of Communications and Networks, College of Engineering. And uh, I've been here for the past two years and uh, uh, I've been invited by PSU based on my expertise in the field of renewable energy and smart grid. Uh, I have uh, supported here for the establishment of the renewable energy lab, including the uh, test bench design and uh, procurement of the components, then equipments and so on. So and uh, we have later on, we recruited uh, some researchers as well as the postdoc fellows as well. And uh, previously, I was with uh, uh, VIT University, Velo India, as uh, associate professor and head of the department for power and energy. So there I had a, a much uh, foundation on this uh, renewable energy. So that expertise helped me to uh, come over here and uh, support for this uh, PSU uh, to establish the renewable energy lab, as well as uh, to progress towards the uh, Saudi's Vision 2030 and United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. In renewable energy, I think it's a big field, right? Yes. And do you have a, a, a specialization in a certain area in renewable energy? Yeah, of course. Uh, uh, so I'm um, much interested and in working on uh, smart grid and uh, smart cities as well as energy efficiency, which is a need of the hour for this uh, kingdom uh, and this region. Uh, and uh, I'm also working on this power electronics. What sparked your uh, research, uh, your interest to research this area of uh, renewable energy? So when I started uh, uh, doing this uh, uh, masters in uh, power electronics, so there uh, I got a spark and uh, which uh, diverted me to work on this uh, area, focusing on this renewable energy area. And uh, also if you look at it, so now there is a huge uh, demand uh, for the energy. So that also created a lot of opportunities to do research. And also uh, when you look at it, so the whole world is facing uh, climate change issues. So that also, uh, uh, just uh, putting interest on this area and uh, I'm keep on uh, exploring many new ideas in this. For example, like a sustainable campus uh, for the PSC Prince Sultan University, then working on uh, autonomous microgrid. So which these are the two projects which I am collaborating with the industry. So you, uh, you mentioned uh, about a project with uh, Prince Sultan University, this university. And is it already uh, implemented or still in the progress? Uh, this is my uh, current project uh, with the two industries. So one is uh, PTT Riyadh. Uh, this is a famous uh, uh, Saudi uh, company and Riyadh. And as well as uh, I'm also working on uh, Conquer uh, Technologies, which is from Croatia, Europe. And uh, these are the two industries which we have uh, cooperation uh, with the Renewable Energy Lab. And uh, one project we are working on Adamas Microgrid with the Conquer. And the second project we are working on uh, PTT with uh, uh, Sustainable Prince Sultan University Campus. So the making the university campus sustainable. So in this two projects uh, I'm working on now. How would you evaluate your research experience at PSU? Uh, it's quite uh, interesting as well as uh, it's uh, really encouraging, uh, especially in PSU. Uh, if you look at it, uh, when I joined here, uh, my citation as well as uh, number of publication uh, is almost doubled now. Okay? okay, so this is what the impact I can say in terms of uh, PSU as well as uh, RIC and in fact, uh, how the PSU management is helping, uh, supporting towards the 
and encouraging for industry collaboration like this as well as uh, publication so uh, we are focusing on both quantity as well as quality publications and uh, in this regard i hope so ric i i should be very thankful to the ric for uh, their wonderful uh, support they are doing for this 2020 especially during this 2020 it's really um, excellent support and what's your future plans what's the biggest uh, research idea you have in mind actually i have already uh, thought of having some ideas on uh, how we can integrate uh, the existing oil and gas uh, sustainably with renewable instead of uh, completely uh, ignoring the oil and gas so why not we have oil and gas put together with the renewable so that we can have uh, something like um, hybrid system so that we can continue to use uh, resources uh, from the oil and gas uh, in the, in this kingdom and uh, another important uh, aspect i am focusing on is the energy efficiency in mm-hmm. this uh, region gcc region because this is uh, very important nowadays because you know very well so here the summer is uh, very lengthy as well as uh, you know the air conditioning system is a must everywhere yes. okay so this consumes more energy so i'm also uh, planning to work out on some uh, ideas in this uh, to how we can reduce this energy demand and energy consumption and how we can increase the energy efficiency so there are a lot of policies already in place uh, even though but uh, how we can uh, technologically we can solve this issues okay uh, that means we have the air conditioning system so instead of this system why not we have some alternate system so that it consume less energy so thank you very much doctor uh, for taking your time out of your busy schedule to for this interview and i hope that your research will continue to progress especially with the help of uh, ric department and thank you very much Ken. definitely so i i have one request uh, to the industries so we as a renewable energy uh, team we are ready to support as a consultant for any electrical related consultancy work and uh, so i am really inviting all the industries in this kingdom uh, if you need any energy efficiency related projects consultancy support are related to microgrid development support are related to renewable energy support we are ready to provide the consultancy for this i i really uh, welcome all the industries and we are also um, would like to collaborate with the, all the industries thank you